As the arsenals of modern warfare keep moving into fascinating and uncharted territories at breakneck speed, one of the most intriguing technologies that keep captivating people's imaginations around the world is directed energy weapons. After centuries of relying on kinetic solutions that require a projectile to be launched into a target, the idea of having a focused laser beam or a microwave blast neutralizing it at unspeakable speeds and without the need for munition has proven mind-blowing. Despite the technology's promising nature, its developers have found one obstacle after another in their quest to polish it enough to be effectively used on the battlefield. But at least one of these obstacles appears to have been surpassed recently. As Lockheed Martin announced in January of 2023 that Deimos, their laser weapon system that will be mounted on a striker combat vehicle, has achieved the first light, meaning that the laser's optimal performance parameters align with the system design requirements. As such, it looks as though combat-ready laser weapons will enter the world's battlefields sooner than expected. The Promise Directed energy weapons, such as high-powered lasers, are the latest type of weapon system that offers significant advantages over conventional kinetic solutions. Such advantages stem from the unique properties of directed energy, which allow it to deliver precise, rapid, and scalable effects on the battlefield. One of the most significant benefits of directed energy weapons is their accuracy. These weapons can deliver a highly focused beam of energy that can be accurately aimed and adjusted in real time, providing the ability to selectively engage individual targets. As such, it is possible to neutralize threats with minimal collateral damage and reduce the risk of harm to innocent bystanders or non-combatants. Another advantage is their speed of engagement. Directed energy travels at the speed of light, making it possible to neutralize a target almost instantly. This allows a quicker response to threats, which can significantly improve the chances of survival for troops in combat situations and help mitigate the impact of surprise attacks. Unlike conventional munitions, directed energy weapons do not require any physical projectiles, as they don't have maintenance costs, lease supply needs, and no risk of running out of ammunition. Moreover, they do not generate any harmful byproducts or pose any threat to the surrounding area, making them an environmentally friendly option. Weapon manufacturers working on directed energy solutions claim the future of warfare will likely be shaped by the increasing use of these weapons, which will provide military forces with a new level of precision, speed, and versatility on the battlefield. But despite the incredible features and the remarkable potential the technology has, its development has faced a rather bumpy road, and many experts are confident that the technology will bring its own set of significant disadvantages. The Struggle While directed energy weapons offer many advantages over conventional kinetic solutions, there are also some disadvantages to consider. These include technical limitations, operational challenges, and cost concerns. That said, one of the primary disadvantages of directed energy weapons is their limited range. Directed energy weapons typically have a much shorter range than traditional weapons, such as missiles or artillery. This can limit their effectiveness in specific scenarios and make it challenging to engage targets at a distance. Laser weapons development has been significantly hindered by the limited range of the prototypes. Despite lasers being composed of focused light and this light being able to cross vast distances almost instantaneously, the beam can be quickly dissipated by particles in the environment like smoke, dust, water, and clouds, making its operational range sometimes deficient. Another disadvantage is the weapon's high cost. Developing and producing directed energy weapons can be expensive, and the high price can make it difficult for some countries to acquire and deploy them. Additionally, directed energy weapons typically require specialized training and personnel, which can increase the overall cost. The development of highly specialized optics for laser weapons is particularly challenging, as the technology is extremely costly, and there's no full-fledged military industry producing the optics at the moment. It would all have to be built from the ground up. 
Finally, directed energy weapons can also have technical limitations. The technology is still in its early stages, and there is still much work to be done to refine the performance of these systems and make them more effective in real-world scenarios. Nevertheless, Lockheed Martin has made a major breakthrough by overcoming many of the technical barriers that were holding the technology back, and bringing its laser weapon system one step closer to operational service. The Milestone Lockheed Martin's Deimos system is a cutting-edge technology that promises to revolutionize modern warfare. Deimos, which stands for Directed Energy Integrated Multispectral Optic System, is a high-powered laser weapon that delivers precise and effective devastation at the speed of light. According to its creators, it will be a game-changer in the military world, providing a new level of protection for troops and military assets. Lockheed Martin has constructed and carefully honed its new weapon to meet strict combat parameters that seek to make it effective even in an environment where laser effects could be diminished. The Demo system is designed to operate in multiple settings, from the harshest desert conditions to maritime and urban scenarios. It is equipped with a multispectral targeting system that effectively tracks and engages a wide range of targets, including unmanned aerial vehicles, rockets, artillery, and small boats. In addition, the system is highly versatile and can be mounted on various platforms, including ground vehicles, ships, and aircraft. One of the key benefits of the demo system is its ability to respond rapidly to threats. The laser beam travels at the speed of light, making it possible to neutralize a target in a matter of seconds. This not only improves the chances of survival for troops in combat situations, but also helps to reduce collateral damage. In an unprecedented stride forward that sets a milestone for direct energy weapons worldwide, Lockheed Martin has successfully conducted its first light demonstration. The trial is imperative in determining the projected quality of the system's beam and evaluating the overall performance of the spectral beam combination, or SBC, architecture. The results were highly favorable, as the laser and its complex optic systems were able to perform just within the range of the parameters established in the design phase of the weapon. The SBC technology showcased the expected performance in enabling the system's power to be adjusted while preserving the beam quality of each fiber laser. The future. Lockheed Martin's breakthrough is a major step forward in directed energy technology and represents a significant advancement in modern warfare. The weapon demonstrated a strong potential to provide a new level of precision, speed, and versatility on the battlefield, and its upcoming deployment is expected to significantly enhance the capabilities of military forces around the world. Now that one of the most prevalent barriers these weapons had to face was broken down, the future of the groundbreaking technology looks more promising than ever, and Lockheed Martin and its demo system are positioning themselves at the forefront of a new era of modern warfare. Only time will tell if the incredible promises made by directed energy weapon developers translate into reality once they reach the battlefields at some point in the next five years. Thank you for watching Dark Tech. For more content about impressive combat technology, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to be notified of our newest videos. And if you want to delve into history's most brutal and important battles, click on your screen and check out our other Dark Documentaries channels, where we publish regularly. Stay tuned.